woman in America. Not just America. Really? Only there's nothing powerful about you right now. Ugh, you always get this way when you're around Charlie Trout. I don't know who I am without him, Sabrina. You guys are doing a really good job here, making fun of this. It's good. Look, I, I get it. I do. You're afraid of what people might think if you change your mind, but you can't care about them. You never used to. You're Claire Carlyle. You're in control of your own destiny. And most of Manhattan's. How did you get so smart? Can't take the credit. It's Dylan. Dylan? We might be best friends, but Dylan and you have something that even you and I don't have. Remember when you won that essay competition and your mother was too busy to even show up to watch you get your award? Who came, even though you treated him? so terribly. Dan came to that? Uh, see, Dylan's always here for you, even when you don't even know it. No matter how you treat him, he cares about you. Not in spite of who you are, but because of it. Dan loves me for me. Uh, yes, Dylan does. Oh my gosh. I I've got to go right now. You know what? That's, that's not your line. <laughs> no, me, I, Blair, have to go. Why would you do this to me? I don't know what you're talking about. You switched the proposal when I saw the Chateau scarf on Alessandra, I knew. I thought that was a nice touch. I'm impressed you know the value of quality. You've learned so much from me in such a short period of time. Mm, you wanted me to know it was you. You can't prove anything. I can't, but when Jonathan Carp sees my real proposal... Will that be before or after page six exposes Dan Humphrey for the plagiarist he is? Whether it's true or not, you will be tainted. And your publisher will drop you for good. You see... You can't win against me, Humphrey. You can't even compete. So this is about Blair. Well, then I guess I'm not competing. I must be winning. You wouldn't be trying this hard if I didn't have a real shot with her. And up until this moment, I wasn't sure if I did. So thank you. Now, uh, if you'll excuse me, I, uh, I have better things to do. Cece, I'm a little afraid to go in. Serena's so mad. Serena doesn't have anything to be mad about. You said so yourself. Well, maybe she does. Maybe she was right. About what? About me denying that I had feelings for you. I came to see you today to prove that I'm not in denial. One of my specialties, warped logic. It is a unique skill you have. It's awful. No, it's not awful. It's you. Couldn't be awful. Humphrey. How can this happen? A prenup and Chuck, Serena? Well, whatever this is, it will have to wait. What if I don't want to? I'm gonna go ahead and see my dad. <laughs> 